Hi everyone, I hope you are doing well. In this video, I wanna talk about five things that you need to know before going to the museums in Amsterdam. Uh, sorry, my voice is a bit weird, I've been ill, but without further ado, let's get straight into this. Number one, it's not free. So this may or may not come as a shock to you depending on what you're used to. In London, for example, many of the top museums there are free to get into, for the permanent collections at least. Now in Amsterdam, um, you will be hard pressed to find a museum that's free. And I decided to look up um, your five of the most popular museums that you can go to here. And I was actually quite surprised at uh, the range in price. So yeah, it's not cheap. Number two, buy your tickets ahead of time and never assume that it won't be busy. Now, I know this sounds like a no-brainer, but my friend and I, we recently made this mistake and we felt like such fools. We were planning to go to the museum at 2.30 on a Friday, so it's a weekday, and we thought, there's no way it's gonna be crowded. We will literally just sail in there. But when we got there, it was absolutely packed. You know, we could only get a time slot two hours ahead so like we didn't want to wait two hours so we had to change our plans but yeah don't make any assumptions about the crowds <laughs> just book your ticket online and ahead of time number three backpacks so the majority of the museums here will not let you bring in a backpack and you will be obliged to either put them in a locker or put them in the cloakroom in terms of your valuables like your wallet your keys your phone um, i find it really handy to have a small little bag to put all of these in and then don't have to worry about that as you're walking around i just wanted to pause for a moment and share some new products available in my online shop. So first off, there is this very large tote bag with anemone flowers, and this has been painted in the style of Delft pottery. Secondly, there is this incredibly plush laptop case with tigers jumping around various tropical plants. And thirdly, there is another large tote bag painted with a fish theme. If you are interested, please check out the link below. Any purchases will really help support this channel. Thank you so much, and let's get back to the video. Number four, audio guides. So some museums will have them, some of them won't. And um, with some of the guides, you can actually plug in your own headphones, so have that jack there. I think it's worth the punt because they're super light to carry. You can just chuck it in your bag and then like it's, it's your own headphones. So yeah, why not? Number five, take advantage of the museum card and iAmsterdam card. If you live here, so if you're a resident here, then it's definitely worth investing in the museum card, which costs $64.90 a year, and you know basically gains you entry into many, many museums. We saw earlier on how much tickets cost for you know five of the most popular museums here, and you only need to visit like four or five museums to break even on this card. Alternatively, if you are not resident here and you're just visiting, then there is something called the I Amsterdam City Card, which is worth looking into, and this combines free entry into many museums and free public transport within Amsterdam. Please hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and also consider subscribing if you'd like to see more videos like this. Until next time, goodbye.